And just real quick, um, I wanted to show the different heights in the mounts, which this is the American Defense with my new um, Hollow Sun 507 with the Vulcan reticle. And this is the old Hollow Sun 507 with the dot reticle. Um, and so basically, the new red dot's going to go on the old mount and the old red dot's going to go on the new mount because this is going to this is going to go on like an AR type platform and this gives you the one third co-witness but I did want to show the uh, difference in height which is you know if you look at it it's substantial and you know the new red dots it, it, it's what I'm putting it on this uh, this this is going to be way too high for what I want it on so this is going to be a lot more lower profile um, but uh, yeah I'm happy with that and uh, boy like I said you know the next time hopefully we see me getting some range time after I swap these two things but uh, yeah I'm pretty happy so um, uh, boy I don't know if it's gonna focus or not maybe I can get the two the two reticles on camera if uh... <laughs> oh man let's see and am I gonna be that lucky? Oh, or is it just gonna look like a circle with a dot? Okay, yeah, you can see the Vulcan reticle. What if the camera would focus? Yeah, yeah that's kind of cool. It, it keeps, yeah, just it, it, it'll focus for a second. <laughs> Come on. Oh man. Mm -hmm. Focuses for a second. Boy, it's hard to do this on camera. Focuses for a second. Yeah, there we go. And then here's the other one. What are my chances? It just looks like a dot. Which it's actually, it's kind of a ripoff of an EOTech. There we go. It focuses for a second. It's just a circle with a dot. Still really cool optics. But yeah, I just wanted to show that. And, uh, anyway, thanks for watching my little seasick video there. <laughs> and like I said, hopefully the next time that I talk to you guys, um, they'll be on their respective, uh, platforms and I'll uh, be getting some range time. Anyway, thanks again.